everybody, this is Caesar with Small Engine Velocity, and I am coming at you with another ruckus video. Please ignore the glasses. Uh, I have been having issues with my eyes at work, giving me a headache, uh, looking at my computer monitors. So, uh, as one of the things I wanted to test was to take off my contacts, which were bifocal and they didn't work so good. Uh, but now I have my glasses on again, and it seems to be working. Anyways. Uh, what was the topic of what's the subject for today? The today's subject is an exhaust. Yay! Finally, uh, I went online to the Facebook groups, and one person recommended a site called Just for Show Rucks, uh, and I ordered one. And then I contacted the owners and come to find out they're Filipino in the Philippines. They build them 10 at a time, I believe, and they ship them to Florida and then they sell them out of Florida. They also sell a whole bunch of other parts. Uh, so the parts you're going to see today is not uh, sponsored. Uh, I purchased them with my own YouTube money and we're going to go ahead and install them today. But here is the part. Da -da -da -da. And here it is. Yay. Okay. So it's a stainless steel header, Ugh. and it's actually quite heavy. Uh, it has a little mounting point for the, the spring. There you go, this is the end. Uh, the, the flange for the bottom of the motor. It has a little mounting bracket to keep it from shaking. Small bore two wheels, probably could use something like this on his and an exhaust. Now, it just seems to be straight through, but it's got a lot of hollowness around the edges, so there's probably not a baffle. The only thing that was a little bit weird is that there's a, a polished piece right here. It looks like it got a scratch. Someone tried to polish it out, but I could really care less. I just want an exhaust. And there you go with weird symbols down here. But the best part about this whole exhaust right here, and it will work for a fatty and a skinny because this is a if you've ever seen that sidewinder exhaust that comes up it comes up the side rather than under and out and over um, this is this is like that exhaust so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and take off the old exhaust and I'll kind of give you a preview as to what we're replacing anyways there it is, and let's go ahead and remove it. Okay, so we got it off, and here is the old exhaust. It is very short and very hodgepodge together. We had to weld this back on because it cracked off at one point in time. Uh, and then recently when I was hitting a driveway, I clipped this and pulled this off. You can see the fiberglass on the inside. Uh, this originally was at the other end of the pipe, but we cut it and then put this together because it, it kept on rubbing against my tire. Uh, it's still good. I believe there's someone out there who said I, I promised this to them, so leave a comment below if that was you, and I will fix this by rewelding it back together, and then I'll get it to you. Anyways, let's go ahead and start working on installing the new exhaust.
And here's what it looks like. Da -da -da -da. I really enjoy the little pieces that they give you. Oh, look, my end is still in here. Uh, it's got the bracket, comes across, holds it steady, which it's very solid right now where it's at. Comes around and bends. I need to rework this wire so it's not so close to the exhaust tube and connects on the bottom. Uh, little spring, I assume. If you wanted to put a different exhaust pipe on here, you could if you could fabricate a different bracket down here. But there you go, like a Sidewinder exhaust. And you know what's the best part? Is this sucker is $200 versus all the $350, $400, $450, $500 exhausts out there. Now, whether or not it has performance or it sounds good, that's still up to debate at this particular point in time. But let's go ahead and do a little sound test of what it sounded like originally. Uh, I pre-recorded it, so let's go ahead and play that right now. All right, so let's go ahead and set up so we can listen to this to what it sounds like now because I'm super curious. All right, it's done. What do you think? Uh, it's definitely a lot more muted than the super short, non-silencered exhaust. Uh, I like it. It's a lot quieter than it, the uh, old one, so um, I don't think I'll make a lot of people mad, but then also at the same time, uh, I'm hoping to get some performance out of it because I'm, I'm missing back pressure from the original. So when I did my 57.1 mile per hour run with the Met Gears on the side of the freeway, that was with that broken exhaust. Uh, now I'm gonna run it with this one and then uh, after I get used to it and we do a little bit of kind of tuning and whatnot, we'll go ahead and see if it runs any better. The website is called just JST4SHWRUX.com. So just for rucks.com. There you go. The, the guy that I talked to is from the Philippines. Uh, I believe the next thing I'm gonna order is the lowered headlight bracket where I take the stock headlight assembly and put it on the triple tree so that when you turn, the headlights turn with it, but that looks like it's gonna take a little bit of rewiring. Uh, also, I thank you guys over at Just For Rucks for sending me a t-shirt that came with that. I'll go ahead and wear that proudly the next chance I get. Anyways, $200. Fatty slash skinny exhaust, Sidewinder, comes out the side. It doesn't have to be super gross like some of the other cheap exhausts out there. I don't have to weld, I don't have to build anything. If you go to Mojo Customs just to get the header, it's $100. In some places it's $110 or $120 for a one inch header to come out. And then you still have to develop your own bracket and you still have to get the exhaust pipe on the end. So, in my opinion, this is a win. For those of you who are on a budget and need to get an exhaust on your bike, this is the solution. I will leave a link below. Please give me some comments as to what you think and uh, hopefully uh, I have solved the problem of why are exhausts so expensive and I think I found the best value for the buck. Anyways, let's see, still uh, time will tell. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more ruckus videos like this. Go ahead 
and do the subscribe click the little bell so you can get a little bit of so you get some alerts whenever i send something out anyways thank you for watching again and i'll see you next time